Welcome to 411 Carline. You can find us at 411carline.com. You can set up an appointment on our website or by calling 952-540-9000. You're also welcome to view the free car packs on our website by clicking on the car packs icon next to the vehicle. Or if you're on mobile, it's at the bottom of the page. There'll be a Carfax Advantage dealer icon or a Carfax One Owner icon, depending upon if the vehicle is a One Owner or not. This is a One Owner. It's a 2014 Honda CRV. I believe it's an EXL, based on the leather. Forgot to look at that. I did look at the Carfax info, but. <laughs> It is all-wheel drive. It's from Massachusetts, so it's relatively clean as far as the underside goes um, and rust. It just it doesn't seem to be as uh, in the condition a Minnesota vehicle would be in. We just put brand new tires on it. It was recommended by the mechanic that ins who inspected it. Uh, the brakes on it, he said, were were newer. You can see the discs there are in pretty good shape. The rears look like they're uh, relatively new as well. They still have the, ooh, it's kind of hard to see. They still have the paint on the rotors, so. Um, it's a one owner with 18 service records, so it's been pretty well serviced. Overall paint condition, it does have some scratches. It has a couple on the hood here, you can see. It's like someone might have like set something on it, maybe in the garage or something along those lines. So um, this one just got back from detail. So there are a couple things like this scratch on the corner here will be, uh, we'll probably have that bumper corner painted so that the uh, yeah that scratch will be gone. But it does have a couple scuffs here and there. It does have vent visors, which are really nice. You can keep your windows open while it's raining. If you park in a garage, you can keep your windows cracked, um, not worry about really anything getting in there. So or people seeing. If you live in like a condo building or apartment building. I have vent visors on my vehicle and I always used to leave them cracked when I lived in the condo building, so. But overall I would say the paint quality is a little above average for the year and the miles. Wheels all seem to be in pretty good condition, I didn't notice any curb rash on any of them. It does have moonroof hop inside here so it's got leather seats leather's in pretty good condition I would say above average for the year in the miles usually with Honda's you get at least some sort of cracking going on um, these ones are pretty clean and we haven't had to have any interior work done started up here sun's kind of low in the sky so we might get some reflections here I might have been rocking out while I was taking pictures 87,088 miles on this one barely broken in for a Honda. Of course, no lights on the dash, it's been fully serviced. Um, let's see here, oh yeah, this is how we get there. You can see oil change is on here, oil life 100%. So obviously we need to put some gas in it, it's pretty low, but um, it does have this info screen up here, which also has backup camera. It does not have navigation, uh, but it does have Bluetooth connectivity, uh, hands-free connectivity, which is here. Um, dual automatic climate control, which is here. You got both dials there. Uh, it does have defrost mirrors, which is really important in Minnesota. Uh, it has heated seats, of course, 12 volt there. And then it has a USB and an AUX there and another outlet there. These are some locking lug nuts. I'm guessing the mechanic must have taken them off. When you put tires on, it does have the factory manuals in there. And of course, you can pretty much do everything from the steering wheel here as far as uh, communication and uh, the radio, as well as cruise control. It does have remote start. Of course, automatic headlamps with fog lamps. It has the eco mode with the buttons so you can turn it off and on, which is kind of nice. Take a look around the rest of the vehicle here. All the door panels, carpet looked good. I didn't really notice anything on the carpet. The back seats look like they probably haven't been used a whole lot. Um, just based on the overall wear, they look like they're pretty, pretty clean yet. So 
They're kind of, this is a new design that I haven't really seen with Hondas. You pull on this little ribbon here, pops that up, and folds the seat all at once. It's pretty awesome. So then you get all this space, of course. So you can just pull the seat back up. And you can put that back down, put the headrest up. So it's pretty neat. All in one motion. Usually you had to like flip them and press buttons and all that stuff. So. It does have the cargo cover, of course, that goes in here. It also has uh, all-weather floor mats, the rubber ones. They're just not in here because it just came back from detail and it's a little damp back here yet. So, of course, the spare's in there, as well as the jack and everything. So, ooh, it looks like you can fold these from here, too. Oh, look at that. I just learned something new. That's pretty awesome. Very nice. That is a definite upgrade. Something I have not seen in the RAV4s, which is impressive. So now that we did that, we'll fold this back up. Seats in pretty good condition, getting carpets clean. No funny smells, non smoker, no pets. Haven't seen any pet hair. Dash is super clean. So, overall, other than the little scratches on the outside here, it's uh, super clean. Headlights are nice and clear. Worked by this mileage, usually they aren't. Of course my phone does pick up the small valve train noise so you'll get a little ticking which obviously this motor is a Honda motor you get some valve train noise anyways but runs nice and smooth everything's works again it's been fully inspected by a third party mechanic shop take a look underneath here it's pretty hard to see but it looks uh yeah my phone won't even focus mostly plastic and stuff, but it looks relatively clean underneath. We're an East Coast vehicle. There's some minor surface rust on some of the components, but much better than a Minnesota vehicle. I'm going to venture to guess that we're the only uh, car business, in, at least in our area, and probably across the country that shows you the underside of the vehicles. Without, uh, without asking, we take pictures of all the undersides and uh, also put them in our YouTube videos. So anyways, that's all for today. You can find us at 411carline.com and set up an appointment there or give us a call 952-540-9000. Thank you.